I'd love to know your emotions right now, what you're feeling, and just what tonight kind of has been like. Um, I mean, shoot, I don't even know. <laughs> I don't yeah. even know. I mean, I don't know what to feel. I'm just happy we won. I'm happy we won. I mean, um, you know, our team has character um, in a game where things aren't necessarily going great. Um, and we knew Cal Poly was going to fight, and they fought really well. I got to give them a lot of credit. Yeah. Um, but, you know, for me, for us, I mean, it's it's our program. I mean, it's our program. It's, it's Coach Turner's program, what he's built. We've done it with our defense. I mean, we, we did hold them to 54 points. And, um, and, our, and our, um, our, our mission this week was to shore up our defense. I mean, we weren't great on the glass, but, um, but holding them 54 points, I mean, that, you know, that's, that's great for us. And, um, and I'm, just, I'm, I'm just so proud to be able to just represent our program. I mean, that's the yep. most important thing is, is be able to represent our program, um, hopefully make everyone around here proud, make, uh, make Coach Turner proud, our players, all our former players, everyone that's kind of come through. I mean, that's, that's what it's all about. I mean, it has nothing to do with me. Yeah. I mean, that's, you know, when you, um, when you win, it's, it's, you know, when you, especially when you've been in somewhere for a long time, it's so much more about everybody that's, you know, put blood, sweat, and tears into what's going on here. And that's, and that's what it's all about for me. And so, um, so yeah, really, really happy that we were able to win and um, continue to you know push towards winning a conference championship. Hopefully, Coach Schroeder is listening right now. I, I know for a fact that uh, he's proud of, of what you and this team were able to do tonight, coming away with the victory. Let's talk about the game for a moment. You talk about the defense holding the 54 points. They shot 30% from the floor in this one. I know it was tough to get shots to fall, but, but what did you think about the way your team was able to play, especially your star player? needing them to rise up and they did for you tonight yeah i mean our starters were really good um you know i, I you know managing minutes and i, I <laughs> it's easy to criticize when your assistant coach or associate head coach <laughs> be like oh, why aren't you playing this guy more um and i've always had an appreciation for what russ has done but it's on a different level right now when you're trying to manage minutes um trying to manage you know make sure that you're as good as you can be as fresh as you can be down the stretch when it's game time and um and the management of that um a lot of credit to the rest of our staff, I mean, Coach yeah. Wilder, Coach Young, Coach Ton, Coach O'Donnell, I mean, they're huge in, in helping me manage minutes. Um, but at the end of the day, it was our starters. In this game, it was our starters who knew what we needed to do to get it done. We did just enough to get it done. Um, and it's stuff we got to build on. And, and we know that we're going to be as good as our depth in a lot of ways. And so our bench needs to play better. Uh, we, we need to not let our energy be predicated on our offense i think we did that a little bit we had really good shots in the first half that just didn't fall and um and i think that impacted our defensive level and it can't be that um and as we go through february we need to make sure that you know if the offense doesn't fall we know that defense travels and by the way we have to travel to las vegas or henderson to to win the conference championship so we need to make sure that we shore up our defense so that we can you know take it on the road with us and and make that be you know what we hang our hat on with this team and um and so that was good for us to be able to do that tonight um, we got to continue to build on it and we're gonna need our depth last thing bent leutchen tonight nine points eight rebounds how about that for a welcome back uh, you know i would imagine you had to have had Bent on some kind of a minutes restriction in this game but that said, uh, I thought when he was in there, he was exceptional. What, what was your takeaway from Bent tonight? Yeah, for, for a sophomore, um, I mean, it, I think we look at him as a veteran player. Um, and part of it is his maturity, um, his poise, and then obviously his performance this year so far. Um, he is a, I mean, an incredible team guy. Um, he's so good. And, um, and all the guys root for him. So just having him back gave our team just a bump. Um, and a lot of credit to both Dean and Akiva, who have had roles change as he's gone in and out, and both of them worked the heck out of their minutes. Dean was so important. Um, but going back to Ben, uh, having a veteran guy out yeah. there, having a guy that you know that you can go to, I mean, he stretches the floor and hits that three. I mean, that's what he does, and we all talk about, but, talk about that offensive side of stuff. But when you're a coach and you look out there and you go, I have confidence in that guy. I trust what he's going to do. I trust his competitive level. That, there's nothing better than that as a coach to feel that confidence. It has nothing to do with really their performance. It's more so what they give you. You know what you're going to get out of them. You, you, you're going to get a competitive level out of Bent. And, and we really got that from that starting group. DJ Davis, Dawson Baker, you just look out there. Pierre Crockwell, you look out there and, and they give you confidence that yeah. they're going to compete. And it's not going to go great all the time. And they were hard-headed throughout this game <laughs> plenty of times. But I'm going to roll with that. Coach Turner is going to roll with that. We're going to roll with the most competitive 
guys that give us the best chance to win. Um, and, and we have that throughout our roster, and that's why our depth is really important. Um, and, and we just need to keep building on it because this team is really good. It's really talented, um, but we need to continue to build. And that's the most important thing that we do through February so we play our best basketball in March. Ryan, sincerely, congr congratulations. It's tough to win. We saw how tough it is to win. On a night where things weren't going great, it's especially tough to win. You did. Well done. Appreciate you, man. All right, that's Ryan right. Battertelli. Thank you so much.